Goodbye, Villa Ama. Hello, Rome. <laughs> Beautiful. Rome is a city that is both romantic and nonchalant about its romance. <laughs> the city exudes character and charm. It's a movie set, and we are the characters. Anywhere you look, you can see a beauty unique in its own. It's like how I feel about Alex. She brightens any place she is in. Put the two together, and you have the perfect romance. Rome, the only city with a country and a city inside it. The Vatican with its own beauty and elegance wrapped up in ancient history and tradition. <laughs> a place that says, see the beauty of God and see the beauty within yourself. Alex said she wanted to write me a love letter on a postcard here, sent from the center of the Catholic world. It was a very sweet gift. This adventure has truly been such a romantic and beautiful experience. Even though this Italian adventure is coming to a close, I know that our memories here will live on forever. Meanwhile, back in Rome, we spend some time seeing all sorts of sights and touring with all sorts of groups and people. We saw so much. The Palatine Hill. Cheers! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Roman pit crawl. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> <laughs> but I have to say, the Fountain of Trevi and the Spanish Steps were my favorite. If you walk the 135 Spanish steps, you will be delighted with a great view and a chance to kiss your partner in a gorgeous landmark. We've seen a lot of steps on this trip to Italy, but these are truly magnificent. A perfect way to end any day. <laughs> The Fountain of Trevi, a beautiful display of public art in Rome, is steeped in romantic lore, particularly when throwing a coin in the fountain. Throw one over your right shoulder to ensure you will return to Rome. Throw two to ensure romance with a Roman, and three to marry that person. Mm, I think I'll throw one, save my coins, and buy my wife a gelato. One, two, three. Cool. Here at the end of this trip, I have to say it was pretty fantastic. Family, food, the sights, I wouldn't change any of it for the world. Cibo, cibo. Cibo, cibo, cibo. This whole thing has really opened my eyes to see that it can be a lot of fun to get in front of the camera now and then, to document what's going on, and you know, just really embrace you know any adventure that we may go on. I'm so, and I'm so glad I could preserve this experience in a way that I'll be able to look back on fondly. At the end of the day, it really doesn't matter where you go, as long as you're with the one you love. Ciao, Italia. Maybe you'll just hop on a plane one day and just go. So don't wait. Don't say you'll do it tomorrow. Don't say you'll do it next week. Just get out there and go. Are you ready? Let's go. Till next time, romantics.